Hi everyone, this is Jane here from Crystal Sparkles Readings and I'm here to put down our cards for next week which starts the 2nd of March. Can't believe we are nearly into March. Well, we are into March today. So, I don't know where the past two months have gone really, but they have gone. So, I'm going to shuffle up the Black and White Faulkner deck and put down one of those for us. Um, the deck I'm going to be using to go with this this month is the Texture Tarot, um, which is a deck I've had for a little while actually. I've done an unboxing and a quick flip through video, so I'll link that here if I can, or if not, I'll put it at the end or down below. Um, so there is a walkthrough of this deck. Um, it's a really, really beautiful deck and it's by um, Lisa McLaughlin Art was produced in 2018. Um, it is available still, I think, on Etsy and I think Little Red Tarot. Not sure, but it's. I'm sure you can still get it. Um, but it's an independently produced deck, so well worth it, in my opinion. So let's have a look and see what the Black and White Faulkner deck has for us for this week. Come in. And we have... Page of Pentacles. So, love, love, love the Page of Pentacles. As you know, if you've seen my stuff before, one of my favourite cards in this particular deck. Just because, for me, in this deck, it kind of comes up as, a, as an additional wish card. Because as you can see, the little girl is there with her dandelion, um, waiting to sort of blow her little dandelion to make a wish. Um, so, yeah, it's a really, really beautiful positive card traditionally speaking through a pentacle uh, page of pentacles talks about new beginnings um but around usually around work business money that kind of area um so your page of pentacles is is saying to you that for the beginning of the week we've got this energy of a new start I mean, it's a new month as well so we, we're kind of moving forward into this new month where we can start to make things happen for ourselves it's um quite a creative card the pentacles to me can be quite creative <coughs> excuse me um so you know it's an opportunity for you to start to create something new for yourself this week um to be able to make a new start start some new projects um, start a new business, a new venture, anything like that is what comes along with the um, Page of Pentacles. I will just show you these cats because I think sometimes people do like to see them. So that is Chinook having a little sleep still. Not really sleep though because she's watching from Merlin who's here. Where are you Merlin? Merlin, where are you? Oh, he's hiding behind me. He won't come round. If he comes round, I'll show him to you. Merlin, come here, look. Come round. Are you going to come round? Are you going to come round or do I have to make you come round this way? No, nope, he's not going to play today. If he comes back, I will show him to you. But he's running around at the moment having fun. Um, so I'm going to leave him to it. So that's your page of pentacles beginning of the week, starting this really positive energy um, of new creations, new beginnings, all of that kind of stuff. So I'm just going to have a shuffle of the texture tarot. Um, this is a really, really lovely deck. I mean, the cardstock is lovely. The texture of it is lovely. Um, but the actual imagery as well is really, really pretty. So let's have a look and see what we have got with this little deck here. Okay, so we've got the world. So here we have, this is the card. Really pretty, so pretty these, these cards. They're just lovely. Um, so the, the world for me, when the world comes up, it talks about many, many, many different things. Um, it can be talking about the end of a cycle um the end of a period of you learning something and kind of having got to that place where you've kind of got it now um but it also comes up for me when we've got like a world of possibilities and because i've got it next to the page of pentacles i'm tending to go with that meaning for it more really so you know things like the world is your oyster you've got the world at your feet all of that kind of energy 
comes up when I get the world. So it's sort of saying to you, you can achieve anything you want to. Page of Pentacles, and the starting something new and exciting and usually profitable as well because we've got Pentacles in there. Um, so yeah, really, really good, strong, positive card, the world in, against that Page of Pentacles. Um, so saying you can have everything, you can have everything you want. Of course, the world does talk about travel. It's interesting that the world comes up for us now when we've got this whole worldwide thing happening um, with the whole coronavirus that's going around. Um, I think there is um, a tendency sometimes for us to really get overwhelmed with things like that and really scared by them um you know i think there, there is loads of advice out there on that and this is not a health advice place but in terms of energy I try not to get too overwhelmed and frightened um you know take the precautions you're being advised to take um seek help if you think you need to seek help on it um but, you know, don't allow that overwhelming fright and scared, fear and scaredness to kind of overtake too much. Because it's very easy to become overwhelmed with, with things like that and I'm really, really worried about them. Um, so it's interesting that the world comes up when, when we do have this whole situation that is starting to affect almost everywhere in the world. Um, but yeah, you know, try not to get too overwhelmed. Like I say take the right advice, follow the procedures you need to follow and all that sort of stuff. But yeah, um, in terms of our week for next week, we've got the Page of Pentacles and the world. So we're talking about really good, strong, positive energy. Um, I'm just going to have a little shuffle of Brian's deck. But before I do that, I've got a little friend that has actually come to say hello in the end. Hello, Merlin. Hey, baby. Going to come and say hi. Oh, hi. Oh, he came in the end. He didn't stay for long, but he did pop by. Okay, so I'm just going to have a little shuffle of Brian's deck and see what Brian has to offer us today for next week. So here's Brian's message. Oh, look, magic. So have a bit of that. All good, finally a happy ending. I love magic. I love the magic card. It's just fabulous. It's saying to us that as long as we keep believing in things that we um, need to believe in, things that we want, um, believing that spirit is there to help us out and to make our dreams and our wishes come true, um, it's, it's a really strong card for telling us that that's where we can get to this week page of pentacles you know not the traditional meaning of the page of pentacles but in this deck it comes up as a wish card for me so make a wish this week because you've got brian there also telling you that there is magic um around this week to actually be able to manifest the things that we want and the things that we need um and also you know kind of the world i i is a is a good strong card in terms of um, making your wishes come true. You know, you can have the world. The, the world is there for you. That's what the world card talks about. So, you know, you just have to believe in it and to allow yourself to embrace all of the good things that you have around you. So hopefully that has helped a little bit for next week. Um, I know last week I did mention about doing some unboxings and I do still have two or three here that I really have to get to. Um, I'm really going to try hard and do a couple at least this week. Just didn't get around to it last week. Last week just ran away with me a little bit and I never got there. Um, fingers crossed I'll be able to get to them this week. In the meantime, if you have liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. Um, if you like this kind of thing and you're into kind of your tarot and oracle and all of that kind of thing, please subscribe to my channel. And thank you to those who already do. Um, thanks to those that are going to subscribe now. That'll be lovely. Um, and I will speak to you all very soon. Bye for now.